Well, today I learned that holds. Always learning something new. Play Megamind, <clears throat> like Giga Chads do. I like Megamind, it's a lot of fun. And without it, I wouldn't play things like Castle, Champion, you know, these things that I would probably not ever feel inclined to pick. But every time I get Fiesta, I just really regret my choices. So, I just don't like playing Fiesta. It hasn't been super unsuccessful all around, so. Maybe if I get into the flow, maybe some Mega Mind picks will make sense tonight. But I'd be really enjoying just picking YOLO. Like if we're gonna if we're feeling ballsy and random, fucking YOLO, you know. At least then I'm not locked into a playstyle that has to change the way I play the game completely. Did not get a lucky snail, which would have been really lucky. I kind of wonder, like. How possible is it to leak Sakura since they nerfed mercenaries? Like, I don't know how, and this might shift, you know, my perception of whether or not it's a good idea to king buff on wave two, but I stand by that it's a terrible idea. That's some crazy tech that this holds. Definitely leaks to a snail. It's too bad. Well, today I learned that holds. Always learning something new. go for, you know, like, triple peewee here. But then I have three peewees on my board. I don't think that feels very good. Fortunately, my aggro is not nearly good enough here. I need it to build even farther back. I probably leak small. Oh, but I get his Sakura. Oh, that's huge. He went really greedy. Yeah, I leak baby here. Needed to just put it a little farther back. Still kind of getting used to the new gun setup. Old habits kind of die hard sometimes. I can't believe he was so greedy here. I could definitely copper resend, right? Mm. <laughs> and then I end up having just a bunch of uh, PBs anyway. Maybe that was not my best 
decision making all around. Apparently, my gun just won't take anything, and that's that's okay. I mean, there are worse things in the world. I'm not super pleased about it, but oh, don't tell me. Not like this. Oh no, he's living. He's fine. I guess I'll build a second one. Whatever. Definitely for the best that I built the extra peewee there, because I might still be going for a little leak. Yes, say I'm super upset about it. Hmm. What have I done here? I'm one gold short of the skelly. But I think maybe it's fine. I am really bad here, so instead of pushing the tenth worker, I will, I will build this bazooka here. Pretty necessary, probably. And I could have sent a little for income, but he looks so bad seven. I would be remiss. I mean, even with this steed here. <clears throat> okay, and my wanderer dies. A really ironic time for the happy Junimo song because I am not happy. Not a happy Junimo about that. At least he gets him back. Would love to send Drake. I should have pushed a worker. Watching my VODs, I realize how just really, really bad at that I am. does one I mean they very likely could come eight right so many peewees it's it's, it's very cringe <laughs> what's up X the amount of peewees on my board is incredibly cringe But pretty good synergy with my, well, there would have been great synergy if they had gotten more than like one heal off. Okay, I take a little bit of a risk that they would skip here, and they don't skip here. So I am going for another leak, which is, you know, this is definitely a warm-up game. You know, you can feel it. You can just feel that it's a warm-up game, right? So I'm playing like a fucking chode. But that's okay. I overbuild. This is the let's just stop leaking play of the game. And then I, if I do get the resend, which I expect, I expect to get a resend for sure, then I push. Even though the rest of my units are kind of trash. A bit of a spot. A bit of a tricky spot, but. Maybe I can punish my guy with the reset here. 
I do get the resend. And my guy's leaking pretty good. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. I don't know, sure, we'll push one more. Why not? I think I after income hermits. Is that just too is that just crazy? It's so crazy that it could work. It's actually really close to getting it on income too. Let's do this. Now they I'm uh, I'm a little overvalued, but my units are literally so bad. Fuck it, we ball. And I could actually get the after income mole, which is what we're gonna do. It's exciting. It might not work. And I might leak again here because I'm a fucking Janny. But this could absolutely work. Oh, he built the big flower. Well, it won't work. Don't look. Oh, God. The prophecy's coming true. Eh, maybe I'm okay. Maybe I am just so fucking golden. Oh, does he still leak anyway? No, never. Alright, we would call that a bit of a sussy baka moment. to the single dragon turtle which is pretty cool I'm just gonna send Drake here I don't know what my guy has in mind but it seems like the play to me fuck it allowance into overbuild Maybe I should have pushed a couple more workers. I would have gotten an 80 cent, which would have been huge. These are the plays of our lives. We push hard off of this. small but still leaks uh, maybe not actually we're in a good spot though Of course, my teammate has been castled this whole time, which they don't know, but it's starting to become 
What do you mean false advertisement? What does that mean? What did you think it said? Do you think I was playing, uh, what's that basketball game? 2K? Oh. Well, yeah. You figured out. You know, I'm not wrong. Titty's out for Legion, right? I'm at the bottom of the power score. Ugh. Warm up game. I assume we send here. Alright, let's give... Let's get a boosted veteran in the mix. Let's do a reroll. Oh, look at this. Tasty. This is good stuff. We'll go Hermit. Oh, and we have enough for another Brute. It's kind of nice when you're not good at math, because then you get surprised by things, you know? They don't send here. I mean, if I were them, I wouldn't feel like super confident, but I can I can see it. Like this guy's strong for sure, right? My guy, though, I gotta imagine he's not that strong here. You know, it's a bold call, but. You gotta admire bold calls. Now they've got the pressure still. And I'm definitely not amazing 15. But I have answers for 15 and 16. So I'm not like... I'm not exactly shaking in my boots, you know? You know, let's go half and half. Because I gotta imagine, looking at our boards, I gotta imagine they come next. So we'll go half and half. Build one Chieftain and one Death Cat. For a little safety. It's too bad I don't have the skeleton still, because a cheap skeleton with all the buffs would have been sick. And sure enough, they don't come here. So I'm glad I... I could have made the full read, right? And just build tons of flowers, but this will do. <laughs> Whenever my teammate makes a call, he says, I guess. Like. I don't know why. It's kind of funny. Here, I guess. Could be in some trouble. Problem is, I think my flowers are gonna tank a little too early here. And might not like, 
be as good as I'm hoping it will be. Well, this is what you would call a perfectly acceptable week. Like, my teammate, who is the one who's on shutdown, is holding. He sent double hermit too. What a joke! What a jokester! Wonder if we'll go 18 or 19. I mean, it's probably 19. Oh, he calls for 20. Absolute mad lad. I respect it. I'm picking up what he's putting down, you know? So let's hide a little value. Try and bait them into going on 18. I should probably build for 18 because my teammate looks quite weak there. And a lot stronger potentially on 19. So. Fucking heartbreak. I have to sell another Peewee. Truthfully, maybe I should have just built for 19, because they might not have the um the mythium to send here, but Okay. They go income. I'm glad I built here. Cause my teammate's receiving a big boy send and despite his value he might still leak because he just looks terrible on this wave so perhaps this was the right read after all especially because i might not even fucking hold <laughs> actually leaking to income send oops well, thank god he sent income i mean sure he made me leak with income but like come on man if you set full we might just be fucking dead here a really questionable choice talk about overthinking it I mean, damn, we would have just been fucking dead there, huh? Some wild shit. Okay, I maybe pushed a little too hard, actually. bad on 20 actually now that I'm looking at it huh huh well suddenly I get the feeling that maybe we could lose this actually if we leak faster than they do on 20 I get the feeling that we could lose the biggest thing we have going for us is a fucking stupid amount of mythium so
pro leaking. It's not scary at all. It's just, you know, being a little silly. I just felt like being a little silly with it, you know? Give us the fattest send possible. Holy shit. It is very possible that mistakes were made in the course of this game, but was it my fault? Absolutely it was. <laughs> you betcha. Alright, we go more. We go another witch. Fuck it. Alright, these are pretty big sense, right? If we lose this, you know. Oh well. I can't imagine though. Oh, what does this potion do? Oh, he's onto the witches in the back. I mean, that's not great, but like he's only killing one of them, maybe two of them. And this just gives the boss more time. Yeah, he doesn't even... He only kills one. That was actually so bad for him. <laughs> Do we leak first? Holy shit. I think we lost. I... I think we lost. Yeah. Damn, and you know, I said it too, I was like, if we, oh man, I was like, I am so bad on 20, and sure enough, we just don't, we don't leak them, I mean, with the 10,000 Mythium we sent on 20, we still, they leaked about the same amount that we did, so, in the end, it ended up being, I mean, it was a respectable call, but in the end, we, we died too much trying to get to 20. You know, maybe this kind of play we needed to do Income King on 17 or something, and then go 20. Because <laughs> maybe if we Income King on 17, then they're like, oh, well, we don't have to go 18. Let's go 19, maybe. Although they wouldn't do that. 